the little venue called the King Edward Hotel surfaced with, uh, with blues programming around 1982-83 and I started to uh, come down and check out what was going on here and it had a huge influence on my uh, direction uh, musically. Blues immersion, you know, uh, we, were, we were right in the midst of it all. It was generally a very, um, you know, lively uh, fun, uh, active, um, uh, raucous place. Buddy Guy, uh, Clarence Gatemouth Brown, they all invited me up on the stage in those first seven years to come up and jam with them. And, and you, you learn by you know fire uh, when you're playing guitar behind Clarence Gatemouth Brown, I'll tell you. I mean, we're just so glad that we didn't lose it, you know, that the King Eddie wasn't just completely demolished and, and lost and forgotten forever. There's been this huge push to uh, restore it and to pay tribute I think to to what has what took has taken place here already it's an exciting time for the musical music community in Calgary I think uh, even beyond blues players and and it's uh, you know gonna be tremendous for generations of audiences to come it's a pretty exciting moment